All right, Alana, thank you. Well, the storm creating slick conditions on the roads, of course. Multiple accidents reported throughout the state today. ABC 4's Lena Takata joining us live from West Valley City with a look at how drivers are faring through the first snowstorm of the season. Lena, we'll send it out to you. Emily, there have been at least 189 crashes on Utah Highway since midnight, and that's according to Utah Highway Patrol. And though, as you can see, the snow has dwindled, UHP is asking drivers to stay cautious. Driving too fast on slick roads can look like this. Dashcam capturing this video of a crash earlier today. Wet roads, I see. It can turn to ice really quick. As snow falls across the state, these are some of the conditions impacting drivers. And for many drivers, it's their first time driving in the snow this season. You just got to make sure you're aware of your surroundings. That's the biggest thing. One truck driver says snowy conditions are even more difficult for people driving semi trucks for a living. We can't always see. We got a lot of blind spots. And in this kind of weather, we cannot see very good out of our mirrors. Utah Highway Patrol saw several accidents involving semi trucks on the highways. In Utah County, where I was a lot of the day, uh, we had two issues with jackknife semis. Um, and I know there was one up in Salt Lake County where, with a semi that over on 215 that caused some pretty severe delays. But whether you're driving a truck, minivan, or SUV, UHP says when driving in the snow, you should put a seatbelt on. Um, seatbelts are always going to keep you safe in the event that you're, you are involved in a crash. Be prepared. Uh, as you're getting ready to leave, make sure you're leaving with plenty of time um, to get to where you're going so that you're not having to speed or go too fast. Uh, make sure that you've got, you know, good warm clothes and stuff.